Assalamu alaikum. I hope you have been well and you're, you've been keeping safe during these very unprecedented and weird times. So COVID-19 has a lot of us at home with our children and they are remote learning and we are with them literally 24 seven now. Uh, for some people, this might be quite a transition and quite a, a difference from what is normal. For me, it's pretty normal. Um, Alhamdulillah, I have been blessed to be a stay-at-home mom now for, I don't know, the last seven or eight years. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. And so it really got me thinking about a very famous hadith. Uh, we never talk about women's status without mentioning the hadith that paradise lies under the feet of the mother. And so traditionally we say this is the case because she has labored you in pain and she has um, carried you to term. And so these are big burdens that she has already fulfilled. But then, you know, there's also the raising and the worrying and the making sure everything is, is good and as it should be. Um, and this applies to the father too, but you know, this is the famous hadith that paradise lies at our feet as mothers. So I wanted to talk about that in a different light. It is so important for you to have a, a mindset of you are actually living your paradise. If you are blessed to be home with your children and you can provide a safe environment for them to learn and grow. Subhanallah, you have paradise. This is paradise for a mother, for a parent. There's nothing more rewarding or fulfilling for us in this life than seeing our kids succeed and being able to support them in, in succeeding. And so I know it's difficult and I know it's a strange time where, you know, we're limited in our activities, but I wanted to give a word of encouragement to all the mothers out there. I, I see you and I know how hard it is, but I'd also like you to think about it in terms of what you have now, because as human beings, we're, we're so forgetful, we're so silly. We don't realize when we have the biggest joy of our life in front of us. And sooner than you think it will end and they will leave your house and you will be wondering, was there an hour more I could have spent with them? I wish there were more time. And we always look back on certain events in our life and we wish we had had more time. So I encourage you to enjoy the time you have, no matter how difficult it may be. Um, I encourage you to acknowledge your privilege as a mother whether you are staying at home, whether you're a single mother, um, you know, we have to be sensitive to the fact that this isn't a blessing that everyone gets. And I think if you put positivity into your mind, your life will be positive. And I believe the opposite is true as well. So in everything, I believe we should say, Alhamdulillah, this is a, uh, mantra for a muslim you have to be thankful in the good in the bad in the whatever the difficult um so yeah so i just wanted to bring that different meaning to this hadith sure paradise lies under your feet because of all of the struggles and the sacrifices that you do make as a mother but it's also right in front of you you know you're just home you're you're able to be there that is a blessing Allah has given to you and we know that when we appreciate the blessings that we have more blessings come so yeah I just wanted to make that little video of encouragement and um, inshallah you got something out of it assalamu alaikum